a Midwest mod feature out onto the track now here. Sorry on the pole will be 59 at Kyle Lafferty on the outside of him with 35 at Trent Wynn. Row number two will be a 74 J of Justin Asher on the outside with a 41, the 81, excuse me, Elijah Keeper. Row number three on the inside will be a 72 of Andy Oss. On the outside of him will be 59 B of Casey Burnett. Row number four will be on the inside will be the 20 of Jeremy Leahy. On the outside of him will be a 33 of Jaron Martin. Row number five on the inside will be 59 of Rob Muhlenberg. On the outside of him will be a 34 of Donnie Ost. Row number six on the inside will be the 14P of uh, Josh Paul. On the outside of Josh Paul will be the nine of Jared McIntyre. Row number seven will be the 929 of Garrett Thompson. On the outside of Garrett Thompson will be the 28 of Sean Burns. Row number eight will be 83 of Scott Campbell. On the outside of Scott Campbell will be 41 T of Terry Phillips. Row number nine will be the 228 of Tim Petty. On the outside of Tim Petty will be the 161 of Joey Wiles. Row number 10 on the inside will be the 26 of Matt Menzi. On the outside of him will be the 12M of Ron Maples. So already one turkey getting away. We give it away another one here in our Midwest mod class. I put a little water down there during our victory lane interview there. So having the cars roll through that, roll that in there into the racetrack there. Midwest Mons also competing for four hundred dollars. So we're stacking up here, doubling up here as Lafferty and Wynn, your front row. Trent Wynn getting his first heat race win here at Springfield Raceway. They're on the outside of the 59 of Kyle Lafferty, also the heat race winner. Heat race number one, Trent Wynn, heat race number two winner. Here we go. The lights will be going off as we get ready to crown another Turkey Bowl Midwest Mod feature winner. Scott Campbell starting in row number eight. Last year's Turkey Bowl feature winner. Green flag in the air. Racer. Went off to a great start as he comes out of turn number two down the back stretch and the turn of referee. As the 59 of Lafferty in the 72 of Oss battling there for a second. And here comes the 33 of Jared. Martin, or excuse me, the 41, I believe. The Terry Phillips. Or Corre 
action to 51B. The 59B of Casey Bur Burnett there. And now your new race leader. A lot of 50s in this race. As the 59B of Casey Burnett, your new race leader out in front now as the 32-5 of Trent Wynn falls back to second. As a caution on this Flag ways, caution on the speedway as we got a car over there in turn number three and four. So the fifty nine B of Casey Bur Burnett out of Cameron, Missouri. Your 35 of Trent Wynn, your second spot, 59 L Kyle Lafferty, the M third, and the 81 of Elijah Keeper. But the 9X will be, of uh, Jared McIntyre will be in front of the 81 of Elijah Keeper. As another water truck coming out onto the racetrack. Of all these water trucks in the infield, we might have an indoor race or something. This hopefully, won't be putting it out that much water, but you're probably going to be rolling trucks. Help us get the track rolled in after we do a little track prep here. After this feature, it looks like they're getting prepared for that. So. Track is clear now. Getting the line up here, situated here is a pace around Springfield Raceway. As the scorers get in the line up here situated, they had a busy night so far. You got 200 cars and getting the line up here situated is all the classes besides one has more than 20 cars in it. So we appreciate everybody up in the tower and all the track crew. Everybody working together to make sure this turkey bowl is one to remember here. As the 35 of Trip Wynn now having the choice between the bottom and the top, he chooses the bottom. So the 59L of Lafferty will go on the outside of him. Then everybody else will follow accordingly. So the 9 of Jared McIntyre will be on your next row. And the 81 of Elijah Keeper on the outside of him. Your next row will be the 72 of Andy Ost. On the outside of him will be the 33 of Jared Martin. Green Buck flag back in the air as they come out turn number four. Burnett, him win, battling there for the lead as caution on the speedway. And they got a car turned there in the, on the back stretch there. 
Looks like that is the 72 of Andy Ost. As the helmet is off there on the racetrack there. Trentwood right now on the 35, sitting in second. He's out on Marshfield, Missouri. And in front of him, your leader, the 59B of Casey Burnett. He was in heat race number two, started fourth in the heat race and finished second. And tonight in the future, he started sixth. And now in the lead. I also want to keep your eye there on the 59 of Rob Muhlenberg. An inductee into the Ozarks Racers Hall of Fame here. A month or so. As well as I believe the 83 of Scott Campbell. Don't see him on the racetrack. So it looks like he was in the pit area, so. And the 12 rim of Ron Maples over in turn number three, the bottom of turn number three, so. Track crew working to get the track clear here. They're hooked there to the 72 of Andy Oss there. To the off the racetrack there and on th in with the tow truck. Start lights are going off. We're going back racing next time. Green flag in the air. Race on. Burnett out in front there in the 59B with the 35 of win. Yen second. Caution on the speedway. As we got two cars there in turn number four, I believe the 161 of Joey Wiles and the 20 of Jeremy Leahy. There in turn number four. As both of them cars able to pull away, drive away from that, so they'll tack to the rear of the field. Single file restart once again as they'll stay on the single file. Here we go. Lights are off. Green flag in the air. Race on. Lap 
Lafferty and McIntyre. Battling there for third as they come out of turn number four. As the line of McIntyre now up in the third spot, we're battling with the 81 of the keeper. As they come out of turn number four, but Burnett still the leader in the 59B. As Keeper and McIntyre battling there for third win. Looks like he's getting ground there on the 59B of Burnett. As your second place car right there to 35 and win. Trying to Catch up to the leader there as well as hold off the 81 of Keeper and the Knight of McIntyre who's battling there behind them for third. Halfway. Caution on the speedway. As we got two cars over there in turn number four. So I believe that is the 41, Terry Phillips over there, and the 34, or Donnie Ost, if I'm not mistaken, over there in turn number four. As the 59B of Casey Burnett, you know the 35 of Trent Wynn in second, the 9 of Jared McIntyre in third, and the 81 of Elijah Keeper in fourth. As we're single foul, I believe we'll be staying single foul. That's the 34, Donnie Oss getting the toe off the racetrack there. As they're making their way over there in the pits. Here we go, single foul. The lights are off. We're we'll tighten it up here, but stay in single file. Get on the edge of your seats. Things are going to get very interesting as we're over halfway through this race. Ring flag back in the air. Lynn and Barnett was battling there off of turn number two, but Burnett. Serial leader going into turn three and four. Coming out of four. Lynn, right on the back bumper of the 59B down the front stretch. Now he's on the inside of 59B, but here comes the Knight of McIntyre. As now McIntyre is on the outside of the 35 of Lynn as they go into turn three and four. Trent Wynn, Burnett, 
Jim McIntyre and Keeper all battling there as here comes the 33 year Jaron Martin also coming into the picture as your top five all right there pretty much close together as they come down a front stretch. Red on the inside standing right there with the 59B of Burnett as they go down the back stretch in the turn number three. Here comes the 81 of Keeper. Keeper running the bottom side as he'll be sticking his nose on the inside of the 35 of Wynn as we're three wide there coming out for the turn number two and now in the turn three and four as Wynn goes around in front of the 81 of Keeper. Caution comes out. As we are three wide battle there for the lead as the 81 of Elijah Keeper went on the inside of the 35 of Wynn and and them two went around and brought out the caution. As the 59 of Burnett still your leader. As the 35 of Trent Wynn being told to go tailback. As there you go on the FK Robbins instant replay right there. Of what went on there in turn three and four. So there you want Roger Keeper in second. As he did not stop and right through there in turn number four, kept going. So he keeps his spot there in the second spot. As the nine of McIntyre in third, Jared McIntyre in the third spot there in the nine X with the 33 of Jared Martin in fourth. In the 59 L of Lafferty, the M5. Here we go. Lights are off. We'll see if the 59B of Barnett will be able to hold off. The 81 of Keeper. Also keep your eye on the 9X of McIntyre sitting there in third. Green flag back in the air as they come out to number four. Keeper on now on the inside of 59B of Barnett as the caution comes out for the 59 L of Lafferty, I believe. So we have two 59s that look exactly the same, but I believe that is the 59 L.
So the 59 L of Lafferty getting those machine fired back up. As the Turkey Bowl brought to you by Bad Boy Motors title sponsors. We get ready to get closer to crowning another turkey trophy and a check to our Midwest Mod feature winner. Here we go, lights are off. We get ready to go racing. Green flag in the air, Risa! Keeper and Barnett battling there, bound the back stretch, side by side, going into turn number three. White flag in the air, one more lap to go. Will Keeper be able to hold off the 59B of Casey Barnett? As they want to turn number three. Now four. Coming out of four, who's it going to be? The 81 of Elijah Keeper. Your Turkey Bowl Midwest Mob feature winner. Ladies and gentlemen, out of the race car, the only one of Elijah Keeper, your Turkey Bowl Midwest Rod feature winner. Situated here, down here in Victory Lane, with here the Indian one of Elijah Keeper. Elijah, with a great race on the fourth. Uh, had to wait for it there, 59 to one It looked like he was going to take it, but you waited there. Great opportunity to take the lead, and you wasted no time and came home with Turkey Bowl Midwest Mod feature winner. Thank you, thank you. That was a that was a hard race. It didn't really it didn't really go there at the start like I wanted it to. I lost a few spots, but. I was able to get to the bottom and it started started going forward and get forward again. Me and the 35 got together down there. There was just it, I hate it for him, but we just got together. There was nothing I could do. He came down and I was there. But this feels good. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. Your Turkey Bowl feature winner in the Midwest Mod, Elijah Keeper.
So some water being laid down around the Springfield Raceway before we roll into tonight's B Mod A Main. There'll also be a hot lap session for the super late models. You can see them sitting over in the staging lane outside of turn number two. They will get a brief hot lap session before the B Mod A Main that will roll out after track prep. The first 12 late models that made it over to the staging area will get a complimentary set of hot laps to help iron in the racetrack as again we've laid down a little bit of extra moisture over the racing surface so the b mod a main will